Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be doing another organized photo cards with me, but this time I'm actually going to be talking. Um, the last one, the only reason I did it where I wasn't talking, I just put music over it, was because it was late at night. Um, but since I'm awake and I have three days or two days off, um, I was like, you know what, let's go ahead and make some cool videos. Also, now that I am... I've reached a thousand subscribers. I'm able to monetize my videos, which is really exciting. So I'm trying to eliminate the amount of copyrighted music I put into my videos, which also means that my intro and my outro might change, but I was planning on changing them anyway because I've kind of decided to up my game a little bit and get better editing software so I can do a little bit more. I kind of want a shorter intro and also kind of include like more 17 because right now it's just Hoshi and also a lot of people think Hoshi is just my number one but actually my number ones are Hoshi and Dino so I kind of want to change it up a little bit um but yeah so lots of changes but I also really like watching these videos when people like talk in them and don't put in just music I also think it's kind of satisfying to like listen to them talking about their collections as they organize Okay, so I have my little box um, that says organize with me. So as my photo cards come in, I just put them in this box. I also have some bigger things that I'm going to need to put in as well. I just put them off to the side. This Johnny thing is actually something I sold. So Johnny won't be going in my binder. I don't even collect Johnny. <laughs> um, but I also have my sleeves over here. I have my binders all behind me. But first we're going to open up my cards. And I'm going to sleeve all of my cards. Um, I don't know exactly which brand I use. I just bought one and then just kept buying it because I like them. They're softer sleeves. They're not super thick. Um, so I will link them below with what uh, what they are and where I get them. I get them from Amazon. Alright, so here are all the cards that I have. Um, just have some 17. Twice, here's the pre-order set. This Wooden, actually, we'll talk about it later when I go to put it in because it's a really exciting and cute story. Uh, then I have this Jungyeon, Chan, Yeti, some Tsui, some Twice Groups, a few Yoongis, a Hoshi, Fujin, and a Jihyo. So there are all of those. Um, so let's go ahead and... Oh, sorry. The bigger things I have, I have this Tsui um like what is this called lenticular that's what it's called then i have these rujin postcards that i bought because i did not get the pre-order benefit even though i pre-ordered the albums for some reason i didn't get the pre-order benefit so i had to buy all her pre-order stuff but that also meant that i didn't get all the other members so i just decided to buy her set um and then i got this my teen postcard um we will talk about that, why I have that <laughs> later. So let's go ahead and sleeve all of my photo cards. So a lot of people I've noticed don't really sleeve their photo cards. Um, like other collectors that I see, they don't sleeve their photo cards. The only reason that I do is so that they, it like makes them a little bit thicker in the pocket so they don't slide out. Um, some people do it just because like, uh, just to keep them protected. I guess that's kind of why I do it, so they don't fall out and like get bent or something. I just kind of do it so it's a tighter fit and so they don't move around in the pocket and then like get crooked. It just kind of bothers me, so I just kind of put them in a sleeve so it's thicker and they can't really move around. Um, but yeah, things I don't sleeve though, I don't sleeve um, pre-orders and like things like that. So like these twice group cards, they're pre-orders, I'm not gonna sleeve them. Um, just because, I don't know, I don't want to waste sleeves on them. And if they do get damaged, it's not a big deal because they're cheap cards. They're cheap. They're not, like, cheap, but, like, they don't sell for much, so I can buy them easily is what I mean. So, yeah. So, really happy to have this Yeti PC. This is, like, I don't know why, I just really love it. And it was, like, my number one priority. Um, okay. 
This Jungnam's kind of damaged, I just noticed, which kind of sucks, but that's okay. Woojin looks so cute here. Alright, and then yes, yeah, so like I said, pre-orders, I don't sleeve. But then these 17 ones. These cards are actually already thick on their own. I keep saying thick and I feel like someone's going to like yell at me. <laughs> um, but I still want to sleeve them just for consist consistency. It would bother me. Um, but yeah, I am so like lucky that I pulled so many of these OTU cards like this version. I've decided to just go ahead and collect all 13 members for them uh for this version i mean um just because i have so many already and if i can complete it pretty quickly i might just buy another set and then see what else i want to collect i was just going to collect my top two biases hoshi and dino but then i pulled six out of 13 cards for this so i was like let's just go ahead and <gasps> no i dropped it go ahead and collect those so all of my cards are sleeved i don't have as many cards as last time although i do still have a lot of trades coming but i want to go ahead and organize my binder a little bit all my binders so yeah all right i think that's everything out there my desk is a little messy so i'm done with these i'm gonna put those back Sorry, I'm just fumbling with my little shelves over here. All right, so now I'm going to sort the cards by the binders. So there's my twice. Put 17 here. Other boy groups, twice. Uh, oh, I actually have all of my girl groups in one. So twice is still in my girl groups binder. BTS moves to X. This is actually in my second. These are both in my second 17 binder. And those two go over there. So I only need four binders today. So let's go ahead and start with my other boy groups binder, which would be, um, there's Stray Kids. Oh, you know what? I actually just changed up my binders. So these will actually go in the same binder. I used to have NCT is now one of my alt groups and I used to have them with all my other boy groups and then I had Monstax and BTS in their own binder but since I no longer alt those two groups and this binder is kind of bigger I decided to put all of my other boy groups in here so NCT now has their own binder. I think I might have left like a soloist in there with them. I'm not really sure what I did. I don't really remember but these will actually all go in here. My desk is very big, but like, oh sorry, I still find myself running out of room. So, um, also something I also wanted to talk about was how I decided to put in some of these filler cards in my binders just for blank spots. I don't have fillers for like, like if there's a card that's going to go there, it's just empty because like the card is going to fill the spot and I don't want to like waste paper making extra spots. Um, but so you can see I did that for most decks. I just chose random colors and stuff. The colors don't really mean anything. I just kind of chose stuff. Um, so I did that in all of my binders, actually. I think my twice binder and my 17 binders look the best with them. Um, but we're going to go ahead and skip all the way to BTS. So let's see what Yoongi I have. I have his You Never Walk Alone, a tear and a persona. So, I'm trying not to bend these pages. So, for their earlier stuff, I just put in black. But then for the, um, for these, I decided to use pink. So, really excited to have this Yoongi. I got it through a group order. So now for her, I am just missing Jin's version L and Yoongi's version E. So those are priorities for me. Um, I'm so thankful to have, oh, I just broke something. Oh my goodness, why am I like this? I'm very, very happy to have both of these cards. Um, they look so pretty. Excited to complete her. So 
Tear is one of the collections I decided to keep Jungkook for because it was my first comeback with BTS and honestly one of my favorite photo card collections for BTS. So for Tear, I know I have the Yoongi, I believe it's version O on the way. Yeah, Yoongi version O on the way. So I'm just missing Cookie for version O and Yoongi for version U and then I'm done with Tear. So that is only two cards that I'm missing for tier. So two cards for her, two cards for tier. Answer has been complete. Persona. Oh, wait, I didn't even realize this card completes Persona for me. OMG. Wait, that's a really exciting. My BTS collection is slowly coming together. Ah, oh, that's so exciting. Wait a second, I'm excited. So I'm missing four cards for Love Yourself. Persona's done. You Never Walk Alone was only two cards. Wings is done. I don't have HYYH Part 1 or Young Forever. Um, and then I'm missing three cards here. And then those are groups. So I'm not missing too many things. That's really exciting. I'm excited to complete BTS. After I dropped Cookie, I started to feel a little bit more accomplished. So maybe once I complete, I can go back to collecting him. Um, he's just kind of expensive, but I think BTS is planning on making a comeback soon. So maybe I will hold off on that. All right, so now we go to Woojin. He is one of my alt biases, but I decided to keep him in this binder. I thought about putting him with NCT, but I'm not really sure how much I'm collecting right now just because I have a decent amount, but he also has a lot of photo cards, so even though he's one of my alt biases, it's not a priority because I don't have a lot of Stray Kids albums yet. I want to wait till I get albums, see my pools, and then trade those and stuff, so that's why I'm kind of holding off. But I don't remember where these cards go, so I think this one goes right here. I'm, I forgot to make placeholders for him. I probably should have done that before this video, but I think that goes there. And then this is yellow wood. It goes in one of these two spots. I think this is his outside version, so inside outside. So we're gonna put that there. All right, and then I just put these two little green in there. I don't know why. Um, I decided that I want to get his little sticker thing for um, it's Mido, right? I think that's the album it's for. So I want to put that there. So I'm going to move his yellow wood pre-order thingies down here. Okay. All right. Uh, Bam Bam, I haven't, again, been working on him because I'm waiting to get more GOT7 albums. Um, so, but I did do a trade for present you and me. I already have one of those, but I have another one on the way. I forget which one I think think it's I think it's version 8 that's on the way he has a white turtleneck on so yeah bam bam though his cards are so pretty and I really want to prioritize them I just like can't until I get albums so all right so no I put Rowook and TXT in here put all my postcards OMG why is this all the way back here this is BTS. Um, that's another thing I'm missing. The only thing I'm missing is for this is Jin's Seasons Greeting card. I already have Jungkook and I thought about just trading it for Jin, but I think since I already have it, I just want to go ahead and collect it. So this should go here. So for selling gins, I might not actually want to buy it yet. I'm still on a buying hiatus, trying to restrain myself because I have so many comebacks, but. So there's that binder. Next, we're gonna go to my second 17 binder for these OTU cards and this Hoshi card. All my binders are on my bed behind me. Okay, so here's my second binder. So, I forget, honestly, <laughs> which version this is. This is for Happy Ending, but I forget which version it is um so this is how i've decided to do happy ending i saw people doing this for nct 
um, for, what was it? Not regularly, regular irregular, where there's 10 photo cards. People put them in the corners in the middle and then just put fillers in the middle. So since there's five photo cards for happy ending for both of my biases, I decided I was going to do that. Again, I don't remember which version this is. So I'm just going to put it in the middle and then move it later if I need to. So yeah, I don't know. Um, then these Ode to You cards, I actually think I put, yeah, I think that's what this is right here. I put in some pages already when I bought them. Um, so here we go. So I always do Hyung line on one page and Maknae line on the other. So Coops, even though he's first, he's going in the second pocket. I'm just going to use the first one as a spacer. So Hyung line goes all the way to Jihoon. He is the last one on here. So Sunjo, Jolan, Jisoo will go right here. And then the rest is actually Maknae line, the other ones that I have. So I start with Sokmin. I put them in age order, so Sokmin goes first. And then Mingyu and then Minghao will go right here. And then Hansel, who will skip Soon Gwang because I don't have him. Hansel. And then Chan is in the last row, sadly, by himself. But that is how I normally do OT13 sets for photo cards. Um, I can show you these, like the season's greetings. That's how I did it. And then for these, uh, the carrot kit cards. So, although Chan was accompanied by a group. So that's how I do it. All right. So this keeps falling out. So that is my second 17 binder. Um, we're gonna go into my, uh, my NCT binder. I also cut my teen in here. I'm thinking now that I've looked at the other binder. So I have this my teen postcard. So what I did was I bought another Fuzzle album from someone. Um, and I bought it mainly for the inclusions so I could trade them with someone else um, because no one really trades my teen. So I just kind of had to buy an album, see what my pools were, and then trade. Luckily, I found someone on Twitter who was reselling the album. So I was able to trade. So I bought it with Unsu's photo card and June Soap's postcard. June Soap's actually my second buy. So I was planning on keeping this because I already have Chonjin's photo card. But I bought it with an Unsu photo card and then I traded it, that Unsu photo card, for Chonjin's other photo card. So I actually have his other photo card on the way. So now I'm only missing the group for My Teen Go, which is like impossible to find. I don't know if I'll ever get it. Um, but so I have um, Chonjin's postcard already. Jun Sulp is my second bias. So I was okay with just keeping the postcard. Um, the other person wasn't interested in it. And then we also traded a couple puzzle pieces. Um, I didn't get any... I got one Unsu that she needed, um, but I didn't get any Junsop or Chonjin puzzle pieces. And they didn't have any to trade, so that's fine. I'm not really worried about getting the puzzle pieces. Um, and then here's this set back here. So, yeah. So I decided to, because my team, even though they've disbanded, they are still my alt rookie group. For now, that'll probably change once I lose interest because they're not doing anything new. Um, but I decided to keep them in with NCT for now. Alright, moving on to my girl group spider. Um, we're actually going to start in the back because I have only a couple of things for other girl groups. I have a lot of twice, so I'm going to save that for the end. Um, so... We're going to start in the back with my Itzy. So I have this Bujin. Um, I actually have all of these things coming. I didn't make another spot. So I'll put this in here since I'm moving this to put it here. So I am just waiting on her other two photo cards to get here. I've traded for both of them. So she will be complete, ready for the next comeback. 
Itzy is a JYP group, so I expect the next comeback will probably maybe have a lot of photo cards. I know Twice in the beginning didn't have a lot of photo cards, so I'm hoping that JYP like holds on a second and like lets us catch up on Twice before they start giving Itzy five or ten photo cards each album. So for now, Rujin is actually complete. I'm just waiting on the other photo cards to get here. So really excited. I love how this page looks and their photo cards are just so freaking cute. So really excited. But yeah, like I said, I had to buy the pre-order Polaroid, but it's okay. The other ones I was able to trade. So just waiting on them to arrive. And then for Yeti. So I have one of her other photo cards from an earlier album coming. But this one, oh, next page is here. And then I just put in purple fillers because that is her color. And I think it'll look really cute. So even though the backs, you just see the white. But yeah. And then, oh shoot, I forgot. I totally forgot to, I showed them to you, put in these um, postcards for Rujin. So I don't know. I think this is the It's version and the Icy version. So put them in this way. There we go. Okay. <laughs> I like looked over and I was like, oh wait. All right. So anyway, for Yeti, um, I am trying to wait again till I get more Red Velvet albums to start collecting her things, but I was able to make two trades already. And I actually am waiting on her postcard from Reva Festival Day 2. I have that coming. I traded it for my Wendy. Um, so yeah, so that is all for my other girl groups. Really excited. All right, so let's go ahead and move on to Twice. So I have, um, let's see, I have these. Those are What is Love. Um, there's that. Okay, so I think, what comes first? Signal, probably, right? So I have Jihyo's holographic card. I decided to collect all nine members for that one. So just because it's really cute. And I entered a group order as well. So I have um, Mina and Sana on the way. I've traded for those. And then I actually forgot to... No, no, no. Wait, I'm not in a group order for this one. I'm in a group order for the TT holographic photo cards. But I was lucky enough to pull Taeyong in my first one. And in my second one, so I was able to trade that for Jihyo's. And then I have Mina coming from another trade and um, Sana coming in from another trade. So, all right, um, moving on. I think these pre-order sets are next after Likey. So, yes, so it's just one pre-order set actually. I have the green version from Mary and Happy. I bought a used copy of Merry and Happy because it was so cheap and it came with the pre-order set and I want to collect all Twice's pre-order sets so that's mainly why I bought it. It was really cheap and it came with the pre-order set. It came with Sana's CD and I actually messaged my friend, she's Sana Bias, to see if she had the album yet and I would trade the CD with her for whoever she has really. I don't really mind. I just like getting my friends um, their biases so... Yeah. All right, so yay! There is that pre-order set. They all look so cute. I love Mary and Happy's concept. Um, but yeah, all right. So moving on, what is love is next for me. So um, I don't remember which versions these are for Tsui. So let me just look and see if any of these are the same thing. Uh, so this one goes up here. So I recently stopped collecting Nayeon and started collecting Tsui. I think I mentioned that in my update. Um, my Twice Bias changes all the time. I also mentioned it in my Feel Special video. Or like my 17 and Ode and Feel Special planning video. I mentioned that I'm collecting Tsui now. Um, so got rid of all my Nayeon. But I mostly just had Cheung anyway. Um... And then this goes here with this jam. Um, what is love? I have both um, copies for, so I can now start buying other photo cards for it. Um, but yeah, so then for 
So I have this is like my main priority where it spells what's love. I only have three cards right now, but now for these, I'm just missing Sana and Momo's cards. Oh, I didn't realize I wasn't sleeving these cards. Okay. The scratch cards, I am not sleeving. I kind of forgot. Got back in here. All right, so yeah, like I said, this Jonghyun is kind of damaged. It's not too bad. I just didn't know about it. So, all right, but it looks good otherwise. So just missing Sana and Momo. Those aren't a big priority. I will probably just try and buy them for really cheap, but not right now. It's not a big um, deal. So if this would focus, hello. Okay, so there we go. Now moving on to Summer Nights. I actually don't have any Summer Nights albums, so I'm trying to hold off on these. I did enter a group order, so hopefully I don't pull any of the cards that I have coming. Um, but I didn't buy too many for Summer Nights, so I'm not too worried about it. Um, but I do have these groups, which actually are at the back of my binder, so those won't go in here right now. And since I'm missing all three albums, I am waiting. I'm not sure if these were a pre-order benefit or whatnot, but, um, or like a first press benefit, but I was leaving these last three spots, two of them being my biases, um, for that, for those to see if I pulled anyone different. Um, but yeah, and I have the big Polaroids. All right. So the year of yes, right after yes or yes. I have this one Sui card I can pull in, or put in, I mean. <laughs> so pretty. The Year of Yes is one of my favorite photo card collections, but I have just been lazy with it. They are kind of expensive, so that's why I've kind of put it off. Alrighty. And then, Fancy, the only thing I have to put in here is this lenticular of Sui. So there we go. So pretty. Um, and I actually, for my birthday, received a gift card from FYE. So I am going to, I bought an extra copy of Fancy just for extra photo cards. So expect some trades for those because Fancy is not done. I was pretty well off on my Nyon collection, but then I decided to trade. I have a few Zooey's coming in, but some of them I just traded two different eras, so I'm missing a lot of cards. I'm completely done with Chaeyoung, so I'm focusing on Mina and Sui. Um, but yeah, so I bought an extra copy. Although I did promise my sister any Jihyo cards I got, I would give them to her, hoping I don't pull all Jihyo, because that is her bias. She just recently started standing twice, so that's really exciting. Um, but yeah, so the last thing we have to put in here are these pre-order cards for let's see where does summer nights go i think it's i think it's just this middle slot right so i don't remember which is which version though so i'm just gonna put them in a random order so there we go okay so i'm just missing what am I missing? Is there something in between the year of yes and fancy? Or did I just leave that spot empty? I don't know. But maybe I messed up. I don't really know. But I have these three spots down here for feel special because I did pre-order that. Um, but yeah, that is all I had to organize and put away today. Um, I hope you guys enjoy this video. I kind of like watching these types of videos where people just talk about their photo cards and sort them. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching. I hope this is something I can keep doing because I kind of enjoy it. Um, and I hope you guys want to see more of it. So yeah, that is all I had. My next videos will probably be just unboxings of the albums that I'm waiting on and stuff like that. So stay tuned for those. We have some exciting comebacks um, announced for October. So TXT, BTS, um, AB6. So October might be a little bit busier than I expected. So we shall see. Um, but yeah, I will see you guys in my next video, whatever it is. 
Uh, bye.